a monologue for our quarantine cabaret from my repertoire. It's one of my favorites. Cook for you? Not till after we're married. I'm not that kind of girl. I'll sleep with you anytime you want, anywhere. In two months I've known you. Have I refused you once? Not once. Give your fingers a smack and I'm flat on my back. <laughs> I'll sew that into a sampler for you when we get to our new home in California. We'll hang it right by the front door. <laughs> because I, I'm a rotten lay. I know it, you know it, everybody knows it. I'm no good in bed. It's no insult. I took that sex test in Rita's Digest two weeks ago. I scored 12. 12, Artie. I ran out of that dentist office with tears gushing out of my face. So I face up to the truth about myself. So if I said that I would cook for you now and not sleep with you till after we got till after we got married. By the time we did get to that motel near Hollywood, I, I, I'd be such a disappointment. You'd never forgive me. My cooking is the only thing I've got to lure you on with, to hold you with. Oh, God, we've got to save some magic for the honeymoon. I'm aiming for two million calories. Oh, Hardy, I want to cook for you so bad. Every time I walk by the A&P, I get hot jabs of chili powder inside my thigh. It's all... But I can't. Not till those tickets to California are safe in my purse. Till Billy knows we're coming. I got that ring right on my cooking finger. Don't tempt me, Artie. I love you. <laughs>